Okay. She know about the mother girls, but she don't say nothing about it. <laughs> oh, shoot. What's good, everybody? Welcome to What's the Chat of Larasha? What's the ch 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 Chat of Larasha? We're getting ready to do another treasure box reading for the overall collective. The song that's on in the background is Psychic by Chris Brown. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment as well as share. Hit that notification bell. Select all. We have 7-7. Seven, seven. Lucky at 7. Somebody could be... Getting ready to have a lucky break is what I just heard. Somebody getting ready to have a lucky break. Not like a lucky break, like a work break, but a lucky break when it comes to bringing you success or when it comes to bringing you uh, abundance, okay? Prosperity, okay? So we got nine. We got nine in the chat. We got nine in there too. So mm, nine represents movement, taking action. The first card that came out is empowerment, so you could be on this movement, this state, this 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 journey, the path that you're on is something where you are gaining back your stability, gaining back your power, okay? Um a lucky break. I feel like you're getting ready to have a lucky break cuz it's getting ready to put you in a position that um you ain't been in before. Like you're getting ready to go up a step. Whatever it is that you're doing, you're getting ready to get a uh, it's going to go up. It's going to go up. Okay. You could be on, a, you know, uh, a motivator, yeah, financial health. Yeah. You're getting ready to money, money, getting ready to be. I don't know. I don't know. Like, okay. So think about this, right? Cause it even got me thinking about this. Let's just say you get all this money. You don't even know what the fuck to do with the money. Like, you do have some things, you know, you want to buy a car, you want to take a vacation, get a house, you know, go shopping. Those things, you know, you want to do. That's the ordinary shit. But what do you want to do? So I feel like somebody's going to have to make a decision. Let's say if you have all this money, you could be opening up, you know, centers, opening up, you know, empowerment, you know, uh, organizations, societies that have to do with women, children, you know, whatever it is that you're doing. So I feel like, um, and then it's going to bring in more, pros, you know, more abundance and more prosperity for you. So I feel like somebody's life is really going to change by whatever financial break that you're getting ready to get is what I just heard transformation is underneath here inspiration is underneath so i feel like you're going to open it up some type of center you know a healing center i don't know whatever it is that's your situation is something that you have dreamed about it's been a part of your goal and this money that you're getting ready to do is going to help you your well-being is getting ready to change so some of y'all could be like i said helping open up a drug re recovery program a center a hospital or you know abusive you know women that have been abused you know children that are homeless well-being i feel like this is going to be something that's going to be very empowering it's going to be it's going to be so power like it's going to be a big power move that you're getting ready to make with this money that you get and i feel like a lot of people possibly knew that you were this type of person and then some people are probably going to be shocked on what it is that you're going to spend and you're going to invest your money in right but it is for the overall well-being i feel like of others so it is something that you're doing where you're possibly getting ready to be a leader and you know you have this empowerment movement that's falling behind it okay you have silent hill in the background we have kendrick lamar uh, and kodak black your well-being being is going to go to a whole nother level as far as not struggling and not having to worry about certain things yeah lightening your load your load is getting ready to be lightened you got a lot of weights off your shoulders that's getting ready to be taken off of you you have had the weight on the of the, you know the world on your shoulders on your back um, things did get heavy, things did get sticky, things did get, you know, you had trials and tribulations that possibly did, you know, scar your mental, but you still kept going. You were that little choo-choo train, choo-choo, keep going. You became, in, you know, you, you became inspired by the things that your life, uh, what your life purpose brought you, right? Whatever position that you're getting put in. And then also, again, you're getting ready to be inspiration to other people. Like I said, you are this empowerment, empower I can't I can't even say it right. And power mental uh force. And I feel like you're helping a lot of people. And I said mental, I, I stutter on mental, I like 
uh, for a reason because it's a mental thing that you're bringing to certain people as far as when it comes to bringing them back stability as far as when it comes to their mind body and soul so some of y'all could be opening up like a yoga i don't know whatever you want to do i don't know i know with me i have always if i got money i always talked about opening up a rehab center a hospital where people can go to it because of the things that i dealt with as me being a soul survivor with my childhood seeing a lot of family members friends people that was close to me getting hooked on these drugs and then you know not having anybody to help them recover from it from the ones that really need that want the help so that was something that ha has always been something that i have stuck to doing because again it was something that fucked up my well-being right if you're mental if you dealt with that in your childhood or if you deal with it in you know older days whatever it's something that is a mental uh trial and tribulation that you have to go through so i feel like that's going to be something that's going to be helping uh you know the overall collective if you are getting ready to be fortunate to do something like that okay and i feel like whatever money that's coming in is also going to like i told you take a lot of burdens now you ain't got to worry about how i'm gonna pay a bill da, 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 da. you got a, a lot of money in your account shit that shit could be on overdraft you know not before you was getting overdrafted right but this now is like where you gonna put it on what do they call that shit octo where they drafting the money out monthly auto drafts that's what i was trying to say you gonna have that and it was crazy because i saw a meme a while back that said you got to be a responsible motherfucker to have your bills getting drafted out of your account every month <laughs> i don't say it was something like that you got to be a responsible motherfucker to have all your bills set up on auto pay so that means that you're gonna have enough money where that it ain't even gonna be a problem with you because you know everybody struggle you have had your trials and tribulations you have had your good days your bad days right so you have had experienced it all but this time i feel like that auto drift draft is gonna be on for the rest of your life right so um you ain't gonna have to worry about anything like that anymore is what i'm hearing okay They said, uh, you got to be a responsible motherfucker to have your uh, all your bills set up on auto draft. <laughs> okay, so let's keep going. So, yeah, somebody could be having some type of come up. You know, if you struggle, shit, I have struggled before, shit. No, we all been through there, right? Through the, the having those times, we all have had those times, regardless of what month it was, what year it was. You have those situations, right? Unless you one of them motherfuckers that you grew up and that your mama and them and daddy and them and your bloodline got money and all that shit, they already got you set up. A lot of regular life in society, people ain't set up that way. So you have to go through those certain uh, situations where you have certain tower moments. But I feel like this is getting ready to put you in a situation where, like I said, you ain't got no motherfucking worries, okay? Ain't it a song that says, uh, I ain't got no worries? What is that fucking song? Song that's on right now is Best Friends by The Weeknd and Summer Walker. Isn't it a song that says, Ain't Got No Worries? Or it could be a different slogan and I'm just fucking it up. But I ain't got no worries. I think there is a song that's saying, Ain't Got No Worries. It's a rap song. Yeah, I feel like you're making a big career change, right? That's possibly going to have to do with travel. You could be traveling. New beginnings underneath it. So, yeah, I feel like you're getting ready to go. You're getting ready to live way beyond your means of what you used to be living. Okay? Some of y'all, part of your fucking new career and career path, or if you got enough money, shit, you ain't working for nobody. So, you're going to be majority of your time traveling. You, you, you have certain, you know, uh... Little Wayne, so it was Little Wayne. I ain't got no worries. Yeah, so that's the song that I'm hearing. I ain't got no worries. You got 144 in the chat, 62 likes. That's the song that I'm hearing. I ain't got no worries. That's what you're going to be bumping in, bumping in the back of your head for the rest of your life. Okay, some of y'all going to have CEOs, you know, you the CEO, you're going to have general managers, district managers to run your shit. You, you having meetings, you know, either press conferences in front of them or on the motherfucking phone. Like, that's how big shit you getting ready to be. You ain't got to be there. 
You ain't got to show up every motherfucker. You got motherfuckers working underneath you. Only time you show, show, showing up in there is if your money's short and somebody fucking up some shit. <laughs> That's the only time you going in that motherfucking office, right? Like, but it look like you're going to be traveling. You're going to be on, you know, possibly in Barbados or whatever, making phone calls or fucking uh 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 brazil and you over there having a uh, real google meet meetings but it's your company and your business and you doing shit so i feel like this is where somebody getting ready to go you're getting ready to go there and it's getting ready to be a new beginnings for you so you have leave the door open by bruno mars playing in the background okay so somebody's life is getting ready to change real quick in a hurry so somebody want to leave the door open. I'm sipping wine. You look too good. I look too good to be alone. And that's what your mask went over here now. Now he's saying, you look too good to be alone. My house clean. No, you was not talking about that earlier. Somebody definitely watching you high authority. You was high authority. You are a chosen person. You are somebody that's meant to be put on a pedestal. And they're getting ready to show you the pedestal that you're meant to be put on is what I'm hearing. I don't know who this is. If this is a job that's getting ready to surprise you with some shit, they finna, they finna surprise you. I mean, surprise you big time. And now if it's a lover, if you feel the way that I feel... They trying to come through. They want you to come through. So we have coffin reverse. Somebody passed over. Somebody could get some money from some life insurance or inheritance. Inheritance. That could be some way that some of y'all getting ready to have a come up. Somebody could have left you some money and you didn't know. It could be. I, I did not have. We. I did a reading where I stated before. That there could be a boss that could possibly pass away. And when this boss passed away, they left you some shit. And you ain't had no clue that this boss or this co-worker left you some shit. And you're going to be like, and that's how you're going to know how much this person really respected you. But there could have been somebody that did you wrong. And once they realized they did you wrong, they had to put you in your, they will. Oh my goodness yeah somebody did they tried to block you so whoever tried to block you they put you in they will so somebody could have already been sick or they once they start fucking with you and they start trying to sabotage you they end up getting sick and they knew exactly why they got sick right and now this per and this person have put you in their whole will because they know that they did wrong by you is what i'm hearing somebody gonna get like somebody getting ready to get a surprise like a real surprise or if this is a job that's getting ready to do this to you they doing it because they see that you're high authority they possibly could try to has try to stop you you know put mazes and blocks in your way try to you know you know put an anchor on your ship but again you motherfucking peter pan tinkerbell the name tinkerbell came out earlier today so you tinkerbell peter pan you uh you know even captain hook if you want to be the motherfucking villain but somebody uh definitely was trying to sit there and try to stop you and it's the the actions um the consequences that this person could be getting is death you got lovers in here so somebody could have definitely been trying to block your love relationship and then they put you in they motherfucking wheel yeah, somebody loyal. That's crazy. Their well-being changed. Yep. Now I'm, I'm realizing what I just said. So somebody's well-being changed after they crossed you. That's crazy. Hey. Hey. Somebody getting ready to get... <laughs> I don't even know what the fuck is say by that. Like, that, that's weird, right? Shit, I think whoever is getting ready to be put in this situation, your mouth gonna be on stuck mode too because you're gonna be like... 
probably and let's say if this person did this this person's family let's say if this was a boss or this somebody that was a motherfucking enemy if it was an enemy they family no but if it was a boss like and a boss was doing shit behind your back and then these family members find out that your name is are the whoever is re they reading this will and they find out that your name's on this will i bet you there's even some people that thought you and this person possibly had a secret relationship and y'all didn't it was just that this masculine or this feminine did wrong by you and they feel like that they deserve you deserve the money. Yeah, that you deserve the money because of what they did. And that's the only way that they could repay you. So somebody could have been low. It's somebody that's it's probably like a CEO or a big boss man that did you wrong. And right now that their health is bad. Our child, like I said, this could have been an inheritance when you were a child. Yeah, somebody gambled a certain situation. They were childish. They were childish behaviors. <laughs> and I, what I was going to say is that there could... Okay, so the one that's mad is whoever's child this is. So let's say if it was an older man or an older woman or a man or a woman their real child is pissed off because you're getting money from their father or their mother is what i'm hearing shit you could have even got more back than what this child got or you got something that this child wanted and they didn't get it you got it somebody's situation has been stuck for so this has been going on behind the scenes for a while and you don't know about this yeah you got an anchor here this child was trying to stop something stopping you from getting the payout this child could be an adult or it could be a child like a child that can speak what's the the youngest age over here well, shit, they over the age of 18 to make a decision. You got 18 here twice. And then you got the number 35, 36, 39, 19, and 43. So those could be very significant. Then you have three underneath here with this marriage, so... But I feel like it was a child that was at least, you know, that's 18 is they consider it as shit. Adult, you know, theft. Yeah, this person feels like you can't, like, for real, for real. It is a, it's a fucking boss. So there is a boss that's getting ready to give you some money and their family was involved in stopping you from getting this money is what I just heard. And they feel like they thought you had a secret love affair. That's the reason why that lover's card came out. They thought you had a secret love affair with this person and you didn't. It was just this person shaft you so much. This is their reap what they sow judgment. You, was, you end up being the loyal person, the loyal employee this whole time. Yeah, poverty is underneath here in marriage. So you also get a mature man, toil and labor, burn bridges. This is all work related. Our papa situation, if it is a, a child, you got privileged lady here. Situation when it comes to your inheritance. Like the yo yo what did you got left back from your family members or a family person? Okay.
Okay, so we got 224 in the chat. We got 106 likes. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, as well as share. Let's see what zodiac signs are uh, significant to this reading. I don't know why I can't speak right now. I feel like this is going to leave whatever you're getting ready to get is going to leave you spe speechless. You're going to be probably speechless for a, a, a good time because you I don't think you've seen any of this coming. We have Aquarius energy that fell out. You have 11 here. So collaborated. There could have been somebody that could have collaborated against you. We have Gemini. We have the number three. So there goes that number three showing up and number 11. Some of y'all could have had a trust account since you were three or the age of 11 that you didn't know about. Or you possibly knew about it. You just didn't. Like they t they could have told you about it and you could have thought something happened to that 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 trust account. Somebody could have lied to you and said that you had a trust account and then they told you about it and then they said, Well, I don't know what happened to the money. Uh yo, granny lost it, whoever passed away, they lost it, they didn't keep up with it, or they withdrew it, and this whole time they didn't. This person had access to this money and they never told you about it. So that could also be a situation that has to go on with a childhood. If it has to do with childhood inheritance. We have Leo energy here. You got a five. So I feel like somebody's definitely getting ready to have a tower moment. So how can you switch it up on me? So these could be people that switch certain things up with you. So there's Taurus energy here. So you got Aquarius, Gemini, and Leo. And then you have Taurus energy here. We have Libra. You got a seven. So you got a two and a seven. So any of y'all, these could have been the ages that you could have had this trust account that was set up for you. You got a 10 here. You got Capricorn underneath it. So I feel like, yeah, somebody getting ready to find out some shit, okay? And then you're going to find out how possibly how, how long this, if it's a work situation, how long this other man or this woman has had you in their will. And it could be as short as two years. Like you already been on their wheel for more than two to three years. Or if this is a situation where it was like one of your family members or a friend that left you something and they passed away. You were on their wheel, wheel more than two to three years. And they possibly never told you about it. So you got 227 in the chat. We got 124 likes. Thank you for the $5. Um, Divine Feminine Living in the UK. Thank you so much. Treasure Box for the overall collective. Treasure Box. One of y'all got two wheel situations coming towards you is what I just heard. Possibly three. One person got three and another person has two. So that could be the reason why your ass going to be paid. Like this, I, this shit has got me speechless right now. So whoever is going and get ready to go through it, it's going to have your ass stuttering. You gonna have to sit there and really regulate of what took is getting ready. That just happened. Like you're going to really have to reflect and sit back and think. And you're going to be like, damn, like it's going to catch you. It's going to throw you off. This shit is going to throw you the fuck off is what I am keep hearing is like, and that's how I feel is going to throw you off. It says, let's chill and make each other laugh. So somebody wants to chill and make each other laugh. That could be an Aquarius um, that could feel that way or it could be any of these signs. It could be Aquarius, Gemini, Leo, Taurus, or Libra, right? Uh, that could feel that way. They want to hang out, Netflix and chill, you know, go to the movies and chill and make each other laugh, whatever entertainment place. It could go to like, you know, David Busters or, 
a main event or, you know, whatever. I don't know. Somebody wants to hang out with you. It says, oh, they know they fucked up. So there could be a Gemini that knows that they fucked up or any of these signs that could know that they fucked up when it comes to you. So I feel like you have a love situation that's going on and then you have a situation that's going on with your money. It says, uh, this brother is causing issues. Wow. So if you got a Leo brother, your Leo brother could be causing issues. A Gemini brother could be causing issues. An Aquarius brother, a Taurus or a Libra. This brother could have been also involved in you not getting your money or it's something that they could have been involved with when it comes to your love relationship. It says you're not like the other girls. So Taurus, they're realizing that you're not like the other girls or the other women or a Taurus man, a Libra man, a Leo, a Gemini or an Aquarius person could feel that way. But Taurus, you is definitely saying that you are not like the other girls or women. So we got Libra energy here. Let's see what's going on with this Libra. It says, this is hard for me, Divine Feminine. So whatever's going on is hard for this masculine. Okay, if it if it was a situation where you had an enemy that is getting, you know, put you in the wheel, shit, it would, whatever they did to you, they knew they fucked up. It was hard for them to lie or get out of the situation where it caused them to put your ass in, uh, in their wheel. And they could have had some issues with family members. It could have been a brother that could have been causing issues. There could have been a brother that could have been involved with any of these signs, a, Li a Libra, a Taurus. Um, if, there, if there's any of your signs over here, Libra, uh, Taurus, a Leo, Gemini, Aquarius, there's a brother of yours that's involved in some bullshit. Or whoever left you this money, their brother is involved in some bullshit. work you let you work in a classroom or cop a cafeteria could be even a teacher or a coach that could have left you money something like that federal credit union like i i all these that's an advertisement so everything that i'm saying is matching on how somebody possibly stole some money you could have had some money in a motherfucking credit union a trust account in a credit union wrong move so somebody made the wrong move when it comes to you on trying to keep your money hostage keep your lover hostage whatever at the bottom of the deck it says all they about to see is jail and commissary so if somebody did do something that was illegal or they try to threaten you um set you up with some foul play bullshit they ass is the one that's getting ready to go to jail and they the ass is getting ready to go see nothing but jail and commissary wrong move is what i'm hearing Okay, so let's get to the index cards. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, as well as share, hit that notification bell, select all. Uh. 
Okay. Oh, shoot. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, as well as share. Hit that notification bell. Select all so you're notified when I do post on this channel. I got my shit together. I'm way better than last time. So somebody could definitely come to you saying it. Or you could be the one that's way better than last time. Okay. So make sure you like, subscribe, comment, as well as share. Hit that notification bell. Select all so you're notified when I do post on this channel. So it says ready for something new so you've been ready for something new are your masculines ready for something new right um again you have a new beginning that's getting ready to come to you it says i hate i hate you and love you at the same time so this could be you feeling this way or your masculine could feel this way it says your life is real and this is the real you so your life is real and this is the real you people were trying to say that you was not real you was fake you know that's not how she live in her life or how he live in her life and it turned out again you the real that this is the real you it says uh, about to put something in stone so somebody's about to put something in stone which could be this ready for something new somebody could be getting in a going in a relationship okay um or somebody could be putting something in stone when it comes to a position it says california so you could be from california or somebody could be visiting california soon it says boy please so you could be telling to somebody boy please um if it's a brother situation, you could be telling your brother, boy, please. It says people know that you're legit. So, yeah, this is for sure. You're the real deal. And uh, this is the real you. And you are the real deal. And people know your ass is motherfucking legit. So if they ever try to uh, question your authority, question anything about you, you showed and proved they ass wrong. It says a pimp and a whole couple relationship. So there's a lot of this going on down there okay uh, up there so a pimp and whole couple relationship somebody could have been in a pimp and a whole couple relationship it says very confused on what to say to you so somebody is very confused on what to say to you it says don't want to see you doing better than them so somebody did not want to see you doing better than them entourage so your masculine could have been involved with an entourage or this whole pimp relationship with somebody that was a part of an entourage so there could have been groupy love and things like that going on the mantis is involved so the mantises could be going on something going on with california and the mantises have something to do with it gang setup so there was a gang setup again um if they were you know in gang so gang setup you could have been an affiliated with a gang or your masculine or feminine could have been affiliated affiliated with a gang the brother family members there could have just been in your journey where gangs was part of your setup a path that could be another thing that's going on too okay a pimp and hoe couple relationship could be a part of this it says birthday cake. So somebody's birthday could be today. Happy birthday to you. If you are a Virgo, today is my twin flame's birthday. Happy birthday to anybody that is um, Virgo or a past bir birthday. Leo season card did come out. Libra come out. Happy birthday to anybody's birthday that's just around the corner. So somebody could be getting ready to eat birthday cake. It says, I like to eat ass. <laughs> birthday sex birthday sex <laughs> oh shit so somebody try to come with it for your motherfucking birthday are you for your birthday gonna be past due shit this could be a past due situation shit my birthday was in may i need that past due birthday cake <laughs> sit 
situation. So somebody you could, this could be you, right? You freaky with it. You, <laughs> this could be also another a pimp and hoe relationship. That that could be liking. I don't know <laughs> what the fuck going on over here. Okay, so it says the ex is willing to fight. So the ex is willing to fight if it's an ex that like to eat. He trying to come back. <laughs> Future is playing in the background. It says you are the best candidate. So you are the best candidate for the job, whatever position that you're getting ready to get. You are the best candidate for your masculine to do this. If it's the first time he's getting ready to do this, he want to do it to you. I don't know. Something is over here going on. Some shit going on over here. Somebody ready to start something new. Something new could be this person doing this because you is the best person to do it for. Someone has receipts on Divine Feminine. Somebody have receipts on you, Divine Feminine. It could be that you like to do this. <laughs> oh, shit. <sighs> oh, no. Are you got an entourage that is set up to do this. They want to do that to you. That could be your masculine competition, and it could include one of your exes trying to come back. It says, spending, sending friends to attack you. So somebody is sending their friends to attack you, okay? It says, now sees you as queen. So this person now sees you as queen, and that's the reason why they're ready to try something new, and they're ready to toss that salad. Sunshine on me playing in the background. Hand deliver check. I was just talking about somebody getting ready to get some motherfucking money. Sunshine on you. Mrs. Petty. So you could be Mrs. Petty with your motherfucking money. It's telling you can. Shit, turn up on a motherfucker. You deserve it. Shit, if it's me, oh, I'm going to turn up on a hater every chance that I get. And they know it. They know it. Like my family members and my friends, they know I am fence to do the motherfucking fool. Cause, and the ones that hate it, motherfucker, I'll make sure you see my pictures, you see my videos, you gonna see bulletins in every motherfucking town and say my name on it with my business shit. <clears throat> Probably even supply could become a become a, a stationary motherfucking business and supply the, the 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 napkins and shit and start putting my business shit all on that shit so I can give it to the whole motherfucking call center and shit. Yeah, we're gonna do some shit like that. Mrs. Motherfucking Petty is in the motherfucking house. Be petty with that shit. You deserve it. Especially if it's a job situation. Or even with it's the family members. Shit, invite all the motherfuckers to Disney World. Whatever money you got. California. You could be taking your family on a trip to California to Disneyland. And you're going to be petty and not invite the ones that you know that did you wrong. <laughs> you've been working harder than what you're supposed to be. So you've been working harder than what you're supposed to be. And that's the reason why you deserve this hand-delivered check. You ready for something new? So you've been doing the, you've been, you've been, your game, your, your grind has been on fleek. You've been working more than what you were supposed to be working. <laughs> a friend set up divine masculine. So there could have been a gang set up. So your masculine could have been in a gang set up and a friend could have uh, set up your divine masculine or whoever was a part of his entourage, his boys. It says, there's a man that hates your success. What did I say? You could pay me my money, though. So there is a man that hates your success. It says might be a scam. So there could be something that might be a scam or that's something that happened to you a while back. If somebody does get a hand delivered check, make sure you pay attention to that shit before you try to go cash it and none of that. It might be a scam. I don't know. It says accusing you of their problems. He slash in her, he slash she life. So somebody's been accusing you of their problems that's in their life. A military church. I should have said that shit. Okay. And this deck, this deck right here, when we were shuffling it, I kept seeing the cross. And I wanted to say that there could be a pastor 
that has your name on a wheel or somebody at a church member that has your name on the wheel that could be giving you money too. I should have said it. I was definitely, when I kept looking down and I kept looking, I was like, fuck, do I need to really say that? I should have said it. But uh, yeah, a military church could be involved in a certain situation. It says you defending yourself now. So you've been standing up and defending yourself now. We got 344 in the chat and 185 likes. And so it says on and off. So you could have been with this masculine on and off, or they could have been with somebody that was an on and off relationship. It says you've been leading the way for others. So you've been leading the way for others and you've been doing the things that you're supposed to be doing. It says watching you and drinking heart activation. So your masculine or your feminine could be watching you and they're having heart activations or if it's anybody that did you wrong, they could be watching you and having heart activations. It says social security jobs. Somebody could work for the social security to place or getting ready to get a job at the social security. If you are watching this and you work here, this work situation definitely could be you. Okay. And it says, and then somebody could have did something with your social security number. It says unsupportive family. So yeah, you got unsupportive family. They don't, they, they, they hate your success. And it definitely could be a male that is upset. That's a family member that you have um, more success than them. Gotta move by Didi, uh, Diddy and Bryson Tiller playing in the background. So if you did apply for a social security job, you are the best candidate. So the mantises is involved in refereeing this situation between you and this person. Or what's going on with this money situation and you being done by, you know, being done wrong by people that had authority over you. Okay, so let's get these names. Oh, some names already fell out. Oh, there go one card. Hold on. Well, let me put this over here. Open to growing with you. So somebody is open to growing with you. So hours and hours is playing in the background. Okay. 
So first name, Sh Shamel. Mac, Guadalupe, Alicia, Alisa, last name Henry, Marika, then I met you. Okay, uh, Ben Guess, Ben Guess. Molina, Winford, Morrison, Wall, Russell, Zon Zona, Lamont, Michelle, Kalia, Estelle. Nathan, Stalt, or Stalt, Kaya, Santiago, two S's back to back, Jeremy, Rodriguez, Mangolt, West, Pardon, Ginger, Abril, Brooks, Best Deacon, so I, that church thing is for sure. Okay, um, Asa, Paulisa, the Baron, Rogers, or Rogers, Divine, Lisa, Artesia. Nathaniel, Tyson, Monty, Gates, M. Bella, two A's back to back, Calvin, Ortiz, Isgreen, Waljecht, BT, Stewart, Melvin, Clint, Natisha, Gaisha, Argaisha, Drea, Mocha, Afti, Efti, Myers, Matthew. Two M's, three M's back to back. Tanisha, Wanda, Rebecca, Zinnerman, Timothy, Donnell, and Cobb. So it says, open to growing with you. Mantises, boy, please. It says about to put something in stone. It says people know that you're legit. It says I hate, I, I hate, and I love you at the same time. It says very confused on what to say to you. It says your life is real, and this is the real you. It says you're the best candidate. California, Mrs. Petty. There's a man that hates your success, accusing you of their problems he slash she has in their life, a military church, it might be a scam, a friend. It was calling me. So I don't know where I, it stopped at. If it stopped, it says it might be a scam, a friend set up divine masculine. So the scam, your masculine could have got set up by a scam through the divine, their friend. Okay. It says unsupportive family, a pimp and whole couple relationship, watching you drinking heart activation. You've been leading the way for others. It says on and off relation, uh, on and off relationship. I guess you've been, you and this person or people have been on and off. It says you, you defending yourself now. 
It says hand delivered check. It says birthday cake, gang setup, social security, social security job. You've been working harder than what you're supposed to. It says entourage now sees you as queen, sending friends to attack you, ready for something new. I like to eat ass. The ex is willing to fight. Someone has receipts on Divine Feminine. And it says Divine don't want to see you doing better than them. So somebody definitely does not want to see you doing better than them. And I'm going to go ahead and end this. We're ending it with 347 in the chat. 224 likes. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment as well as share it. Love y'all.